Your eyes were closed and are now open. What was true is now false and what was false is now true. What that means is little to me and everything to you. I can guide you down this rabbit hole if you wish. Just take my hand as I lead you through. The, the Simple, Simple series. series. Oh shit, is that what I think it is? Dude, I just found the first volume of the Symbol series. We can start an adventure together. That's cool, dude. How many are there? 396. 300 and what? I've made a horrible mistake. Howdy, I'm Eko, and I'll be your host here at the Symbol series. If you don't know what that is, that means just skip the last video. How dare you? Do you know how much work it was for us to make that video? And you're just gonna fucking skip it? What's wrong with you? Go back and watch right now and learn the Stemple series! Quick recap. Back in the 90s, some company decided to publish a bunch of games under the guise of the Simple series for the PlayStation 1. And Japan does what it does best. I've been told that some games in this series are just gold. So, I want to hunt through the sea of mediocrity and see what we can find. If there's anything that I missed that you know of, please send me a message. Or if you want to watch me play live, follow me at StarEco64 at Twitch.tv. Or if you want to know when I stream, because I don't do a fucking schedule, follow me on Twitter at StarEco64. I also like to retweet things like cute possums. Cute possums. Fucking adorable possums. Because I don't fucking understand social media. If you could tell me that, that would be fucking great. That would be great. Now, as a YouTuber, it's my obligation to tell you this before we begin. Like, comment, subscribe, and hit the bell! Let's begin! Wait. I don't want to get comfortable on the couch and then change the game out every 10 minutes. Haha! -ha. Let's go! Right off the bat, we're going to The Mahjong, the first of the Symbol series. Now, going into this, I thought I was going to play Mahjong Solitaire, the only game I think I've ever played in the version of Mahjong. I was genuinely shocked to find that uh, I was wrong. And I'm going to be wrong a lot, so it's great. Anyway, it's not a bad game. It's, you know, a decent budget game. It's the first of the Symbol series. What do you expect? NEXT! Next up, we're playing Shogi. I fucking love Shogi. Because it's like chess, but there's a converting mechanic. And converting mechanics in video games is just fucking best. You can take a piece and you can place it down where the fuck you want. It's cool. What's fun about this game is that it allows you... It shows you, you know, legal moves that you can use with your pieces. And if you mess up, you can push the X button to go back a piece. Uh, I kept the messing up and continuously hitting the wrong button, X. So my most of my turns went uh, go, 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 and then accidentally re undo everything I did. So the game's pretty fun. I can see it being good. Uh, and I'm just shit at it. So, you know, Shogi. Volume three, The Gamoku.
Come on. Come on. No. No, 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 come on, please, 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 come on, god, 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 fucking, This game's actually pretty fun, and I, I could probably keep playing it, but I need to continue on, so. Volume 4, The Reversity. I got this. This one's a lot easier than the last one. Yeah, look at that. Yeah. Yeah, fucking take that. Look at me, I'm fucking winning. This is the best. I got this. Wait, what? Wait. Wait, what? What the fuck happened? What? Wait, hold on. What? What's that? What? How am I already down so many points? What? 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 How did I lose? It is probably on me. I spent like five minutes researching the rules. I should probably have done more research. The next one. The next game is called Volume 6, The Hanafuda. It's an old Japanese card game that I don't understand, so I think I'm going to be good. I mean, I mean the, the cards look very pretty. I don't know what's going on, but it's letting me do things. Um, okay, I, I've got four points now. That's great. Um, eight? Uh, okay, what's going on? What? I, I won? What? That, what? All right. Well... Decent PS1 game, you know? You like Hanafuda? You like PS1? There you go. Volume 7, The Card. Now, this is actually games that I've played before, so I think I'm gonna be all right. Blackjack, I got this. Put me down for 50. 14, hit me. 21, hell yeah, let's fucking let it ride. 18, hit me. 22, that's fine, let's go. Can't end on a losing streak. 16, hit me. 26, fuck it, let's go. 17, hit me. 18, hit me. This game's rigged. I'm just gonna assume the other two games are rigged and we're moving on to volume eight. All right, volume eight, solitary. It's finally a game that I can win. Effect. Each pop, each movement just kind of sends me back, puts me into the ecosystem, puts me into the galaxy. 
fuck is going on here? I would buy the soundtrack for this game. Next! Volume 9, The Chess. Please just be chess. Please just be a game that I recognize, that I can be decent at. Chess on the PlayStation 1. You can't go wrong with that. I'm still awful. I'm still awful at the game. But we're getting better. Volume 10, The Billards. This is pull. More billards. You know, it's pretty straightforward. Pretty fun game. Um, I honestly really like the 3D model for the pool table. It's really nice for, you know, PlayStation 1. Fun fact. Video games like this used to give me nightmares, where it's just like a pure black screen in the background, you can't see anything see on what's going on. I think it all originated from an old Hot Wheels game or something, but I don't know why, it just always spooked me. Like, I can't see what's going on out there, so I'm like, what the fuck's going on out there? But I kind of like this game. It's a good one. Not gold, but good. Now that we're at the halfway point, let's take a word from our sponsors. I'm the only sponsor of these videos. I'm the one paying for everything. I, I need a support. If you if you want to if you want to give me money, please send me a message. Please give eco money at gmail.com. If you want to continue the, the symbol series, please you know please a couple dollars might help. But you know if you can give me like a couple thousand, that'd be we're real fantastic. Thank you. Volume eleven, the pinball. Let's see if it holds a candle up to the superior pinball video game, space pinball. It's actually pretty fun. It even shows you some the rules of pinball. I mean, I can't read any of that, but it's pretty neat that it's in there. Oh, they even have different levels. Cool. Oh, hey. The war board. Oh. It's exactly what I want to think about while I'm trying to play video games. games. Neat. Check out that high school, boys and boys. If you can beat that, send me a photo on Twitter, and I'll call you out in the next video. How dare you fucking try and beat my high score, you son of a- Volume 12, The Quiz. Just get this over with. <laughs> I promise I have a college degree. <laughs> Volume 13, The Race. This game looks pretty good. I mean, I know it's a PS1 game, and it's a budget game, but for a budget PlayStation 1 game, it's, it looks pretty good. Now, I was terrible at the strategy games. I am fantastic at racing games. Just look how gracefully I took my first turn. Um, uh, uh, not that turn. Let's look at the next turn. I love this game. This is pretty fun. I, Unironically, I would continue playing this game. But that engine sound, oh my god. I know a lot of racing games have engine sounds, but that just... It's a little too piercing, and I don't know if there's a setting I can turn it down, or what. Hold on, I need to get serious. First place, let's go! Alright, alright, next game. Number 14. The block. No, it's just Arkanoid, you know. It's a pretty fun game. Sir, our defenses are falling! Hold it together, Private. Don't collapse until we won. We can't hold on anymore, sir! It's going- ah! Pretty fun game. Number 15, the Pachinko. I really enjoy Pachinko Machines. In fact, I own one. Uh, let's see how this game handles up. Why don't 
of you have cute animations too! Volume 16. The Patchy Slot. So this is just basically slots. Alright, well let's give it a shot. Okay, find a slot. Wait, what? The fuck is this? Is this a slot machine from hell? Who are these people? Don't gamble away your souls, kids! Number 17. The Bike Race. Remember earlier when I said I was real good at racing games? That doesn't apply to bike games. Let's fucking go. Alright, let's choose our character. We've got, we've got Ryu, Gin, Aya, Mei, and uh, Bob. I like Bob's fashion, so let's go with him. Ooh, the engine sounds back. That's great. Oh well, I can take some pride in being second place. Wait, hold on. No, no, wait, no, come on, no, first, come on, no, 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 oh, Tom. All right. <sighs> Stuck in the river of shit. Without a paddle. Bowling. My years of Wii Sports experience is finally being called for. Let's go. Oh my god. The game so far has had music in the star of that was weird. See? Easy peasy. Let's go for two. Even champions mess up sometimes, come on. I got the next one. That's fine. Just go again. Please, just just hit one pin. I I don't even care which one it is. All right, I'll I'll take that. Whatever. Let's okay. Bowling. It's bowling. It's, it's bowling. Let's go. We sports did it better. Number 19, Sugoroku. It's. I don't really have much to say about this game. It's a board game. I'm not really good at those. But you just roll a die and you move. Yeah, no, you, you choose your characters. I chose boy, girl, mafia, creep, and busty office lady. Because. Why not? You know? And I'm the only one playing. So I'm pretty sure I'm winning, you know? This is the kind of game that you play with friends, and when you, uh... Don't have any... You win. You just always win. Going through this video... There hasn't really been a whole lot of games that have been wow. And if there's 400 games that I have to get through... I'm not convinced that this is, you know, entirely worth it. You know? I know there's one or two games in the... PlayStation 2 era symbol series that are fun, but if I have to get through 300 games to get to one interesting one, I don't think I'll be doing that. So, you know, this might be the only episode I make. Uh, I don't want to prematurely make, make that statement, so I guess let's finish up with the 20th game and then see from there. Well, strap in, another 380 to go.